Hey, what's going on everyone? This is AJ Rumsa with Beyond the Arc. And my special guest this week is one of the top players that you might not have heard about, but you soon will, and that's Elliot Cole. You came from St. Joseph's. Yes. You, you were there for three years. Yes. You just transferred. This is your first year here at Powerhouse. But what's something that you can tell that's different from St. Joe's and from a school like this? Like St. Joe's is more, it's like a higher rated, high ranked program. You know, it's different things you get. Like we have a weight room. I was always in the training room getting ankles taped and stretching. You know, and here it's like, it's, it's, you gotta come to bring it. You come with what you have. Obviously watching your game, you like up-tempo offense, you like to push the ball. Is that something that when you made your decision you thought, hey, you know, I could probably do better in this up-tempo offense and, and be able to show what I can really do and bring to, uh, on the basketball court? Yes, and I like the, the feel here. You know, it feels like a family here. I like it. And I like the way they embrace me, you know. There was no jealousy because I'm, I'm a humble person. I don't put myself above others. So I just fit right in. This year has been a huge year for you. Um, people that might not have heard about you are, are really starting to, are starting to learn about you and what type of player you are. Uh, have you heard from any specific colleges or is there any colleges on your mind that you would like to hear from? I'm starting to hear from Purdue and Kansas State. You know, my offers are really in Chicago, and I just want to, you know, first I want to get some wins, you know, because winning beats anything. You know, numbers don't lie like I tell everybody. And right now you're averaging 37 points. Uh, you just played Whitney Young, and you had 24 points, the number one team in the state. I mean, it says a lot about your game. I don't really pay attention to scoring. I just do whatever it takes to win. If, if, if we win and I only have 10 points, that's totally fine with me. But if we win and I have 50 points, you know, I do whatever it takes to win. What do you think your best aspect is as a basketball player that you bring to the game? Like I look to pass first more than I would shoot, but I can score the ball. So it's like I bring an all-around game. You know, I'm unselfish, right. but I know how to put the ball in the bucket when you need it. Is there one college or NBA player that you model your game after? Uh, my favorite two players are Kobe Bryant and Derrick Rose because I hear a lot that I play like I Derrick, saw Derrick Rose. Rose. Yeah, I saw it a little bit. Uh, yeah. You know, warm-ups and the swagger and. And the way that you you know you want to pass first, that you definitely resemble in some in someone like that. Yeah, thank you. I mean, I, I like Kobe, like his mindset to the game, and I, I practice footwork. You know, because footwork is a different level. Because in high school, not many people have footwork, but on the next level, that's gonna separate the, the good from the great. So that's what I'm aiming for to be great. Being smaller, it's tough. Um, you know, a lot of people overlook us. But what's one thing that you look for in a college? Um, that you would want to play in? What kind of system? I look for a, a, a school that like accepts me being small because it's not about how big you are, it's how hard you play. Are you going to give up on a play? Are you going to hustle and jump out of bounds for a exactly. ball? And, and it's the tempo and the coaching staff and that family feel. Because I'm the baby of the family, so I have a lot of, I have four sisters and my brother. So, you know, I'm used to being around a family feel. And that's why I get here at Powerhouse. So in college, that's what I'll be looking for. What's something that you want to see as the season goes along, or what's something that you think you can change that you haven't been doing that will help your team win? And I think more things I can do is crash the board and help big man out. I mean, I like putting up big numbers, but I shouldn't have to do that every night, you know, because that takes a toll. Like, I step out on the floor, and not to be cocky, but I feel like I'm the best player out there. I feel like I can do whatever I want to, and that's just my attitude. There will always be somebody at your game that's never heard of you. That would be the last time they ever see you play. So, you know, my coach always tells me your first impression can always be your last, and that's something I keep with me. All right, everyone, this was another edition of Beyond the Arc, and you just heard about one of the players that not too many people know about, but will start to know about, and that's Elliot Cole of Powerhouse. I appreciate you taking time out, Thank telling you, us a little bit about yourself, and tune in to next week for another edition of Beyond the Arc. This is AJ Rumsa.